So we finished Mario Bros. Got three stars in all games. A few Rainbow Boys. Done with Excite Bike. Balloon Fight. Balloon Fight's pretty fun. Nobody actually likes Ice Climber. Let's do Wrecking Crew. I've actually never played Wrecking Crew in my life. See, we're learning and getting better. A stairwell. Let's learn some fun facts about Wrecking Crew while we play. How's that? that the Wrecking Crew was a collective of American session musicians who were employed by... Okay, so bombs make the doors open. That makes sense. Yeah, but it was a bunch of mus musicians um back in the 60s and 70s who were responsible for a ton of top 40 radio hits. A lot of them had a background in jazz and classical music. And they weren't publicly recognized, so that's apparently what this game is about. Is Los Angeles based session musicians. Who'd have thunk? Okay, and apparently part of this game is to spell out Mario, and it's just gonna tell me where they are. Mar. I'm good at spelling. Ah, I see. Well, damn. We gotta restart. But yeah, so the Wrecking Crew were not publicly acknowledged, but they were apparently highly revered by industry insiders. So who would have thunk? I don't really know how that ties into this game. I'm not seeing a whole lot of references to musicianship. Maybe the time period is important. When did when did this game come out? So 1986 in North America. Um so yeah, apparently this is just I find it fascinating, I really do. All right. I feel like an absolute idiot. This game was not based on the 1960s and 70s group of session recording musicians. It was apparently based on the 1968 film, The Wrecking Crew. I feel like an idiot. All you gotta do is look at the film's poster and you can clearly see there's Mario, there's Wrecking Balls, there's his Wrecking Crew. It was actually the last film Sharon Tate was in before she was killed. Oh, it knocks me all the way down. That was... Okay, we learned. I don't really know what the smartest course of action here is. Oh, that wasn't it. <laughs> Just got Sharon tated. Too soon? I get it. Can I kill these guys by blowing up a bomb next to them, do you think? Oh, I killed one of them. Oh, God. That didn't work the way I wanted it to. I feel as though I've made a mistake. Oh, no, I got it. So, in the Wrecking Crew, uh, the character Matt Helm works for a secret agency called ICE. And he's supposed to take down some evil dude 
but these sexy ladies try to foil his plans. That's absolutely what this game is referencing. Sexy lady, falling to her death. Oh shit! Oh god, too many. Oh, damn it. I'm dead. Ooh, we unlocked pinball. I'm gonna hate playing through that. It's my grandpa! How many games is in pinball? Oh, six? We'll knock that out right after this. I'm not even gonna change shirts. We'll be halfway there after this. Oh, bonus stage. Oh yeah, tell me where the coin... What is that? What is this guy? Oh, that's that asshole from the movie. I wasn't paying attention. He caught me off guard. I found it. So apparently, this game um, might be based on a comic book instead. Maybe I was wrong. God, I'm really not very good at this. It's like, I understand what to do, but I'm not very smart, and I can't do it. I did it. All the walls. Oh, I really don't like these guys. Nice little dance. <laughs> I don't want to do it again. Hey! 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 Gotta try it again, boys. And girls. Alright. Wait. I think I have a better idea. Much better idea. Improvement. You gotta give me points for personal growth. No rainbow. So maybe Mario, or who I thought was Mario, oh, is actually the character Dirk Garth. Oh, pff, Dirk Garthwaite. What? Got him. This is easy. I'm gonna have to redo it. Oh, I still got three stars. So I'm trying to read about this comic book, Wrecking Crew. Um, I'm not a comic book guy. And boy, is there a lot of stuff in here that I just don't understand. Spoiler alert, if you plan on reading The Wrecking Crew. Bulldozer dies. Sorry. The characters in the comic are named Bulldozer, Pile Driver, Thunderball, and Wrecker. Knock him down to the ground floor. Okay, that's not gonna happen. Now we know what to do. Knowledge is power. Oh, okay, I went too soon. Patience, young pile driver. And murder is complete. But this next one, I'm not, I'm not too sure how to do this very quickly. Shit. See, as soon as he gets over there, there's nothing I can do. I gotta figure out a way to get... Shit! I didn't mean to restart. Golly. It's literally 5 o'clock. I did it again. I love this guy. He's smart. Let's kill him. Oh. My. God. I'm getting so mad at this game. Fuck! Why do I want three stars so bad? Oh shit. <sighs> okay. I think I have a strategy. Okay. I don't know if that's the most efficient way to do it. But it worked. Oh yeah! There was actually a sequel to this game that only came out in Japan.
called Wrecking Crew 98. Bye. No! Why would you need a sequel to this game? Fuck this game. I get frustrated with myself. I don't know if doing it at the top is... the smartest idea? I wonder what new mechanics the sequel added. Okay, I can definitely do that better. Alright, going for three stars. Tearing down walls, baby. Look at these dorks. They can't figure out nothing. That's three stars. So, and I think 2008, they actually made a movie about the group of musicians called Wrecking Crew. And I guess they were never formally called the Wrecking Crew. It's just their drummer released a memoir in, like, sometime in the 90s and kind of just decided that's what they should be called. God dang fireball right in the damn back. I need to be more optimistic. I know that. You know that. Oh my god, it's so hard to love life with these fireballs. They almost got me. This is another two-star performance. I could see this game being fun. It's not. At least the music slaps. Come on. See those fireballs? Coming for me every time. Three stars. I don't think I can do any better than that. Is there is there a mechanic that I'm missing? Do I not understand the game? I really don't understand how to do any better than what I've done. Alright, I haven't gotten distracted. Got all the walls. Three stars. I don't have to fall. Ah! Now we got this. Easy peasy. I feel like an idiot. <sighs> Persistence pays off. It really does. You're gonna do a lot of things in life where you don't find immediate success and it's easy to get discouraged, especially living in an age where immediate reward is something we've been conditioned to expect with um, social media especially. Boy, oh boy. Daggum. That boy stuck. He counts as trapped. We get on social media, we expect our friends to all like our videos. I feel like that wasn't the smart thing. What is the smart thing here? He's trapped. Okay, this is gonna take me a couple of tries, I'm sure. What was I talking about? You see, I want this channel to be a place where I have meaningful discussions while playing video games. The problem there... Ugh, is that I have literally no attention span. I try. I'm just gonna zone out and talk to you about what I was talking about. So the issue... So the whole point of what I'm trying to convey is that we depend far too heavily on social media. The point I was trying to make. And I shouldn't assume that anybody out there is necessarily guilty of this. 
but I suck at this game. Put your phones down. That's what I'm saying. Unless you're using this your phone to watch this video. Because I, too, need that immediate, sweet, sweet release of dopamine to be able to function on a daily basis. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. What a sexy fairy.